communication globale, vos émotions à travers notre son. Wereldwijde communicatie, gevoelsuitdrukking overgebracht door het medium geluid. La communication mondiale, l'expression émotionnelle transmise par le du son. Okay, guys, we gotta get through that door. Should we just ask permission from those nice men with the rifles? Hello there, YouTubers. This is Elaine, and this is a video blog. Today is Tuesday, February 6th, I think it is. It's been a while since I've done a video, and I wanted to let you know I've been working on one regarding conversion of the uh, Yaesu FT897 HF radio for full frequency coverage for use in the military affiliate radio system. That's this radio right here, the FT897. Unfortunately, there's been some glitches in the uh, production. Some of the clips that I've done when I converted them, they lost the audio, so it looks like I have to go back and re-record it. So. Uh, KG6LWE, Doug, if you're watching, I'm not sure when I'll have that other video done. <clears throat> but at least I wanted to take a minute and say hello to all my other YouTube members and uh, let you know I haven't fallen off the uh, edge of the earth. You'll notice this is a little different view of the library. And I wanted to take a minute and uh, show you a couple of additions I've done. I was at our amateur radio club meeting this last Friday night of the Palo Alto Amateur Radio Association which which meets uh, over in um, Menlo Park uh, just north of Silicon Valley here in the Bay Area and uh, I won three raffle prizes I won a little frequency directory and I also won a little digital voltmeter but the uh, most interesting prize that I won was a real nice microphone for use for uh, amateur radio communications it's made by a company called Heil, and you'll notice the, uh, the fancy boom here. I picked up these accessories the day after I won the raffle, and uh, it's this microphone right here that's on the stand. This is a Heil, uh, I think it's an HM10, and it has a uh, single element in it. The uh, next one up has a switchable narrow and wide frequency response element for uh, both the broadcast kind of voice to it and also more of a narrow frequency range for communications. So anyway, I hooked this up and I've been using this the last few days and uh, Nannergirl88, who's one of my subscribers, she asked me to be sure and uh, <clears throat> do a video and, and show the new microphone I got. She has a broadcast studio kind of thing, so uh, Nanner, if you're watching, this is it. Uh, I really kind of enjoy it. I'm not used to the idea of the image of a broadcaster in the way of, uh, of um, AM or FM professionals that use uh, fancy studio equipment. I'm used to typical handheld microphones, but this is sort of cute. I'm getting used to it. I also have another microphone. I'll get it out of the, uh, the pouch over here. <clears throat> this is a uh, a real sure microphone. It's pretty famous for use in uh, um, uh, music groups and bands. This is the Shure uh, model Beta 58A which is made for vocals and for speech. It's a high output unit and it has a standard 3-pin XLR connector on the bottom. Unfortunately there's another connector I have to order which is on order so that I can interface this real wide frequency response uh, commercial microphone to my amateur transceiver. Um, this microphone takes a four pin connector which is very non-standard for most of the broadcast and music industry. So once I get this other plug uh, delivered in the mail then I'll be able to wire up an adapter cable and try this one out. This one is uh, 60 Hertz to uh, 16,000 Hertz frequency response. This one is a narrower one. This is uh, 600 Hertz to 6,000 Hertz and it's designed with a little peak in the response at around 2,000 Hertz 
and this is for uh, kind of real clear, crispy, articulate sounding speech so that uh, if you have a weak signal it's easier to be heard through a pile up of stations. So that's what this Heil microphone is specifically designed for instead of uh, as a broadcast kind of microphone. But it'll be interesting. Um, I can just imagine six months from now I'll have an equalizer in here and be able to uh, talk on the radio with this and uh, sound like a studio broadcaster. I don't know. I'll give it a try. So that's something new. Also, uh, kind of uh, current events that have happened in the last couple of days. I was a uh, victim of identity theft. <clears throat> I got a call from my credit card company that uh, there were a couple of suspicious charges on my account. And um, fortunately, I've always had a really good working relationship with my particular credit card company. I don't